I want you to come and have a bit of a quick look through the greenhouse with me. I want to show you the fantastic growth we're getting here at the moment, particularly in the new section. It's just mind-blowing how well it's going. I'm off to the USA in a couple of days to take part in the um, Green Acre Organic uh, Farming course. There's two of them actually running, two four-day ones. Fully booked, it's going to be so much fun to go to the USA again and meet with a lot of my friends over there. But right now, let's just have a look and see what's happening before I go away, because while I'm away, I'm really worried about the tomatoes and all that sort of thing like you do because your aquaponics becomes a bit like a baby, you know. Who's going to look after it? Will they look after it right? Will they do the right thing? Well, let's hope so. But anyway, follow me. Let's have a look. As we go past, we've got to have a look at our pawpaws. Fantastic. Just see how they're getting on. They're growing like mad. Look at them. Everywhere you look, these bumper crop pawpaws. See through here. Look at these guys. Look at the size of them, everywhere you look. These fantastic pawpaws, or papaya as we call them. I've got my grandson here today doing the filming. Say hello, Jezak. Hi, I'm Jezak. Watch out, Frank. I'm taking over. Okay, let's have a look at these tomato bushes. These are absolutely doing just so fantastically well. I'm just totally amazed at how well they're doing, even though I've done it so many times before. These tomato bushes are just leaping out of the ground. Look at all the beautiful flower stems we've got already. And just a little bit further up, I'll show you where the fruit is starting to set. So just look at the growth. We've been going along and trimming them out fairly carefully, taking out all the um, extra on growth that we don't want and uh, spending our time, you know, making sure they're held up by the, by the strings that we've got holding them. Let's just come along and have a look at some of the close-ups of some of the fruit we're getting. Here's one just so typical. Have a look at it. Wonderful fruit forming everywhere. And there's more. Just have a look at what a wonderful stem that's going to be of fruit when it's all filled up. It'll be so heavy and fantastic. And more hiding in behind here. Look at those two. Isn't it fantastic? Okay, now that we've looked at the tomatoes and we can see the fantastic fruit growth that we're getting, and just look at the strength of the bushes and how, how look at the stems of the bushes, they're like tree trunks. They're just going fantastically well and all grown on fish poo, can you believe it? Okay, Jezak, I want you to point the camera over now towards the lettuce because I want to show the people how the lettuce are growing. They're really going so well. Come on, let's go. Okay, this is our second batch of lettuce that are coming along since we started this system. And these are green oak leaf. And they're ready to pick actually. Just have a look at them. Look at the beautiful size of that lettuce. Beautiful root system, nice and clean. See, clean and white. Everything is just going so well. Beautiful lettuce. We've got more lettuce than we know what to do with actually. But what I'm trying to do is work this system up to a good um, sized mini farm so that we can actually document the kind of things that happen in a, in a specific period of time and um, we can get some good numbers out to our customers and friends about how to grow vegetables in this wonderful system called aquaponics. What about these lettuce? Aren't they fantastic? Just have a look at them. Just makes you want to go and make a salad, doesn't it? Wow. Okay, I want to talk to you about the nutrient we've got working in this system. It's organic nutrient, fish poo and all the wonderful outputs that come out from the um, nitrification process where the ammonia that's in the system coming off the fish's gills and being deposited by the uh, fish food from out of the fish is turned by um, beneficial bacteria into nit eventually into nitrates. And we have a whole lot of that going on in the system. Obviously, as you've seen, by the fantastic growth we're getting in our lettuce and our tomatoes. And so early too, this system's only been going for about six or seven weeks. It's just amazing. I just want to show you the EC readings we can get when we go into the system. See the light flashing? That's indicating 0.2 of, uh, of conductivity or salts in the system. If we were running a hydroponic system and using hydroponic nutrients, they will all tell you that you need at least an EC of 1, not 0.2, just to grow lettuce. You would never grow tomatoes with an EC of 0.2, they just would not grow. So this is a perfect indication to illustrate that in aquaponic systems, we have a whole lot going on in regard to nutrient production that is not able to be measured in traditional hydroponic ways. 
and that's because the nutrients are naturally produced by the waste from the fish and by the nutrification process that takes place. Absolutely fantastic, I think. It always amazes me just how well it grows. It's just amazing. Look at that there. Okay, let's go. Fantastic. I just can't get over how well these things grow. Unbelievable. I reckon we'll, we'll just take these up to the house and we'll... Look at that, a red one, a green one. Beautiful, healthy lettuce. Never been sprayed with any insecticide or no artificial fertilizers. Just unbelievably healthy food. Let's go into the other greenhouse and we'll get some tomatoes so we can make a fantastic tomato and lettuce sandwich. Come on, Zach, come and get some shots of these tomatoes for me, will you, mate? Okay, point the camera over here right at this beautiful red tomato here. You got that? Okay. Going? Good. Okay. Okay, Zach, zoom in on these ones, mate. Have a look at these for tomatoes. Aren't they absolutely fabulous? And there's more over here and more down here. We're picking tomatoes every single day and more lettuce than we know what to do with. Fantastic. 